What made you? What made you look this up? Seven animals that could defeat an anaconda. Anacondas are semi-aquatic snakes found in tropical South America. They are some of the largest snakes in the world and are known for their swimming ability. There are four recognized species of anaconda. They are the green anaconda, the yellow or Paraguayan anaconda, the dark spotted anaconda, and the Beni or Bolivian anaconda. The green anaconda is the heaviest snake in the world and one of the longest. There have also been reports of anacondas reaching lengths of 40, 50, and 100 feet, 12, 15, and 30 meters, far longer than anything scientifically verified. Number 7. Jaguar The jaguar is one of the biggest predators in South America. You telling me, you telling me a jaguar can kill an anaconda that big? America, growing up to three hundred to three hundred and fifty pounds, one hundred and thirty-six to one hundred and fifty-eight kilograms. I didn't know they got that big. Even though jaguars are well known for their swimming ability in the water, they have no chance. But on land, things are changing. If a jaguar encounters an anaconda, it may fight back in self-defense. However, it would rarely prey on the anaconda due to the size and tenacity of the snake. Anaconda is incredibly slow on land, and the jaguar on land is incredibly fast and agile. Given the environment it lives in and how it has adapted to said environment, it can easily take down the snake. However, jaguars have bone crushing and a strong jaw that can kill anacondas in a single bite. The jaguar has the strongest biting force of all cats around the world, with up to 1500 psi. Number 6. Caiman. bite through a skull. Some caimans are prey for constricting snakes. Cayman. But most caiman species are fairly small for crocodilians. It was a crocodile? Oh, I didn't know that. The caiman is not one of those caimans. At maximum size, it approaches the Nile crocodile in mass and length. In a straight-up fight, head-to-head, -head, the anaconda is going to lose. Like crocodilians, anacondas and other constrictors hunt by ambush, but they are much less capable of defending themselves against large animals if they don't have the element of surprise. To kill the caiman, it would have to constrict it. To kill the snake, the caiman need only bite it. Number five, piranhas. Piranhas are what, South never American thought that. fish with razor sharp teeth and a reputation for feeding frenzies. Large groups of piranhas may gang up on an older, weaker anaconda near the end of its life. Red-bellied piranhas bark to warn predators to leave them alone. The piranhas' top and bottom teeth work they together like bark. scissors to cut up food. They lose and regrow teeth, much like sharks. Piranhas have very strong jaws for clamping down on prey. The black piranha has the strongest bite force recorded for bony fish. Number four, tigers. Jaguars, which are lighter than tigers, have been reported to kill anacondas. So a tiger could likely do so as well. The weight of a tiger can be even heavier than that of an anaconda. If you were to try picking up a cat, who doesn't want to be picked up, you are going to get scratched and bitten. Now imagine that little house cat weighs over 400 pounds. Yeah, but Jaguar could, I, I can see that. And has fangs that are three inches long. Some specimens have fangs bigger than that, that it can drive into you with 1,050 PSI. Elite. Snake skin doesn't cut or bleed man. as easily as human skin, but that will still include this. Sinking those fangs into the right spot on the snake will kill it. In fact, tigers have been known to kill prey much larger than anacondas. On top of this, 
Anacondas aren't as aggressive as tigers. When threatened, they will often respond by running. The bulking snake is more agile than it looks on land, but the tiger is still much faster than it. Number three, lions. I gotta assume. I mean, the big they all in the same family. Let's see, what's the next one? They all, all in the same. Crocodiles, same family. Okay. It's bigger than anything the anaconda preys on, and in all likelihood is too big for the anaconda's method. The crocodile is still most likely to win. It's bigger than anything the anaconda preys on, and in all likelihood is too big for the anaconda's method of attack to do any real damage. On the other hand, the crocodile's bite is more than enough to kill the snake. Its smaller relative, the Nile crocodile, has been known to kill animals much larger than an animal. That huge. That's interesting, though. That was interesting.